If you come to Sri Lanka, you've got to expect the ball to do a little bit. Something similar to the last two T20s. Uh, the spin was a threat for us. Colombo Vishwidhyaling Sandhi Vedanabata Vidyanukola Vishwindumak Otho Shield. Otho Shield. Sandhi Vedanabata Colombo Vishwidhyaling Vidyatmaka Vishwindumak Gandhatne and Dumbi Kevin Nitne. Let's keep a different format. Uh, we, we saw that uh, spin dominating uh, in the last two games uh, in Dambulla. Have you taken a look at uh, the wicket here? How do you think the sp is spin going to play another major role here? Oh, well, whenever you come to Sri Lanka, you've got to expect the ball to do a little bit, especially from a spin bowling standpoint. But yeah, we can't have too much of a predetermined mindset. We have to wait and see what the pitch is going to offer tomorrow. It's important to have an idea, but at the end of the day, you still got to play what you see. It's important that we understand that it can it can look like a dust bowl, but play pretty much straight on. So we got to make sure we're very, very adaptable in that, in that aspect and ensure that we're ready to, to, to play whatever they throw at us. Uh, both Sri Lanka and West Indies are not part of uh, the Champions Trophy. One day cricket with the World Cup, another few years away. How do you sort of, uh, you guys motivate yourself? At first, we, we're planning ahead, we're looking ahead. We've we got to ensure that we're playing good cricket and see if we can get ourselves back up the rankings so we don't necessarily have to qualify this time around. But uh, we've got to take it one step at a time. As, as much as we are looking ahead, we still got to make sure we stay in the present as well. Understand that we've got a few new members, we've got some, some returning guys and you got to gel those consistent performances together as best as we can, especially now when, when things are, are not looking too bright for us for the last couple of years. But I'm sure we, we've got everything in the tank that we need to, to become a, a successful team. This format in particular has been a bit tough for the West Indies uh, over the last couple of years. You obviously did not make into the last year's World Cup. Uh, sort of, you know, I mean, have you streamlined as to any areas where, you know, you can make improvements on and move on? Just all areas, as you can see, we're not where we want to be. But um, it's, it's how it goes sometimes. You can't win every game. But in, in order to be one of the top teams in the world, you've got to be a lot more consistent in all three areas. Uh, so we just need to be more ruthless when it comes to our preparation and the way how we go out there on the field and just, just find ways to win key moments in games and do it more consistently. And one of the positives for West Indies during the T20 series was the manner in which your fast bowlers uh, bowled. Uh, they made uh, life quite difficult for the Sri Lankan batters. Is it uh, one key key area where you'll be depending on heavily? Uh, well, everyone has to pull their weight. I'm not going to single out and say the fast bowlers have to do X or Y. But yes, we, we know the quality of, of bowlers that we have and as long as the confidence is there and the planning is there, all we need to do is execute. So the rest is up to us. Uh, we've got we've got the ball in our court. We've got to make sure we're playing good cricket. Just looking forward to this, this series coming tomorrow. Finally, from me, have you got a team finalized or are you going to keep wickets again as well? Uh, not as yet. Are you going to keep wickets? Yes, yes, yes. yes, yes. Uh, what sort of challenge are you expecting from this series from Sri Lanka? Again, we, we can expect something similar to the last two T20s. Of course, uh, the spin was a threat for us. Uh, we've got to understand that we need to find ways to, to combat that. We've had our planning, we've, we've had our, our discussions around it. And uh, yeah, we, we just got to make sure we, we understand how we're going to go about playing the spin and understand the conditions and adapting as quickly as we can. We saw that spin play an increasing role in the T20s. Are you expecting more of the same? in this, the longer version? Yes, again, when you come to Sri Lanka, you have to expect the ball to, to be shifting left and right, especially from the spinners. And as batters, we got to adapt to that quickly. You can't just rock up and say it's going to spin. Just throw any towel. you got to find ways to score, find ways to put them under pressure as batters. And, and that's all we need to do in this series.